Welcome to Alex Drulich's Magic Submitter Software. I'm David Sprague, and in this training series, we're teaching you how to set up all your items in Magic Submitter. And specifically with this video, I want to teach you how to set up your PDF sharing sites in your items. Now, PDF sharing sites, not all of them allow you to actually get backlinks. But what PDF sharing sites do really well is they rank really well. And one of the things that will really easily put you to the top and position you as an expert in the industry is be able to create really good content that people can engage with, that people can interact with, that people can learn from. And PDF sharing sites do exactly that. So what exactly is a PDF sharing site? Well, let me share with you one right now. One is called a SlideShare. And if we actually do a search for how to create social media strategy, let's take a look at what we find. If we scroll down here, you can see that on the first page of Google with 37 million is a training that's over three years old. So you can see how powerful that Google really looks at PDF sharing sites being a very authentic way to get real good information because remember Google is designed to do one thing take problems that people have and bring content solutions to them and so just like video PDF sharing sites are a great way to share content and especially since most of these uh, sites have content that is very very centric to the topic so let's let's take a look at SlideShare for a second which this is kind of the big Puba of Pubas. I mean this is the big one so let me actually let's go to the main site here so we can see there are just almost any topic that you can think of is here and what these PDFs do or you can upload a PDF or a PowerPoint most people do it in in, in, uh, in, in PDF and you can see here that all these are wonderfully graphically illustrated and it's really they got some fantastic headlines I mean best Android phones for 2011 the value of you know uh, visualization the role of an educator fast and furious speed in the you know opera browser um, building a web analytics process I mean all great content that you'd probably love to be able to look for yourself so not only do you just have one of these but you have lots of these that magic submitter has built in so if you take a look at magic submitter you can see that on the PDF sharing sites they've got all the big ones uh, scribe slideshare you do um, for shared so all you have to do is simply if you want to submit your PowerPoint or your PDF is click on manage items and then click on the plus sign and you're going to simply put your title in your tags and you're going to browse for the file that you want to upload and then put your description now again most of the time let me just reiterate I say PowerPoint because some uh, allow you to do PowerPoint but you want to upload it as a PDF that's bar none so what you want to do is go to your uh, PowerPoint and uh, and print it as a PDF file and then upload the PDF file so uh, so ignore what I just said there when it comes to uploading a PowerPoint it's all in PDF now in some sites like SlideShare they don't actually use a description that you can put backlinks into but you still want to put a description here with a backlink because it not only get your site authority but it will also be able to possibly rank at the top of Google and that's what you want when someone searches for a keyword that is your target market then you want just not your website but maybe your blog your um, your PDF sharing site you know as much as you can your your Facebook site you want them to actually rank so that's simply it but let me go over the layout of what you got here first of all you got a project at the top and projects are a great way to organize all your content so if you created a let's say you've got different niches you've got one the diet and you've got one for health well, you've got one for fitness and this PDF is about fitness you would simply create a project called fitness and you could manage this PDF that you're going to be uploading under there so it's a great way to keep everything organized I personally use it to be able to organize with my clients so every client I take on is a project so I can make sure that all my content is organized that I'm submitting then you simply want to put in your title tags and all these um, all these fields are spinnable obviously not for the uh, the file there and then we're also assuming that you've already created all your accounts as well so you'll see these green check marks on the right hand side and you want to make sure that you create categories because you will not be able to submit without categories categories are a way for these PDF sharing sites to categorize the content that you're submitting to it so let's say this one's on education and this one's on let's see if we've got other education um, 
magazine's newspaper. Now, what you want to do is once you've got everything set up once, if you're in the business or you're in the pet industry or in the health industry, you want to simply save your categories as a template. And you can put health categories PDF sharing sites. And then click Save. And then I'm going to click off of it. And I'm going to go back into it and create a new one. So then I put my title, my tags, PDF, my description. And then what I want to do, so I don't have to click on it. Well, i got to actually fill out. You click Upload in the health categories you just created. Now with one click, they're all in there. So it takes it just a few seconds to set up. But once you set it up, it's just one click away of creating them over and over and over again. One of the great features about Magic Submitter is the ability to create random profiles and submit to them. So you see Bob here, Steve here, Ken. If I was to check all three, then the first one might go to Bob, the second one might go to Ken, the third might go to Steve. And this is a way to allowing you, for you to allow your, what we call footprint, or the way that you submit items to not be able to be easily tracked by Google. Google tracks a lot of things, IP address, accounts, uh, and, and what you want to do is not leave a footprint around so that when you submit something, it feels natural to Google and Google gives you credit for it. Sometimes Google can see that what you're doing, you're doing a lot of submitting and will not count all those backlinks. So that's one thing great about Magic Submitter is it does a fantastic job of with its spinning technology and its random profile submission technology to be able to submit your content without leaving a very evident footprint. So that's your PDF sharing sites. They're fantastic to use, incredibly valuable, especially if you're working with a, um, you know, an author, a speaker, and someone that actually does a lot of different content. Brilliant, brilliant strategy. And for you to say, look, you submit your, your PDF to us or your brochure to us, and we'll submit it to all these sites online, Fantastic strategy, and they will pay top dollar to do it. So that's Magic Submitter with uh, teaching you step-by-step -step how to fill out your item when it comes to your uh, sharing sites. So we'll go to the next training. Take care.